The following is a module for famous opinion. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball GC, and Dragon Ball Super Home by Fuji Animation, Joy Animation, Fuji TV, and I can show you who's worthy for his release. Do you think Goku's base form was stronger than Vegeta's? Or he just had a higher level of Super Saiyan or both? Because that's really where it, it kind of comes down to at a certain point. Like, if Vegeta had Master Saiyan, I think Super it was Saiyan, both. You think it was like, it's like, uh, I mm -hmm. think it's both. A higher base and a higher, like, multiplier. What makes you say so? It's like the, with a higher base, because, okay, first off, Goku's obviously stronger. And it's like, you're doing, like, you're causing, you're causing damage to sell. I, I, like, and Vegeta, like, you're causing damage to sell, fighting him and stuff like that. Causing Cell to use, you know, a decent amount of his power versus when versus Cell using Vegeta to warm up. Mm -hmm. It's like, okay, you're going to warm up the back of my hands real quick. It's like, you, Vegeta didn't, like, you did not get the same treatment from him. Like, you got, based off the same people you fought, you caused more damage to one. You caused one to actually look exhausted versus the other one where he's just coming out unskated besides that one time he let himself get hit by the final flash but i look at him as like doing like some cocky thing like you can't do nothing to me that's true but which is strongest you, attack like but, to, be, to be fair mike what? though right regardless mm -hmm. if like okay let's say their bases are the same goku has master super saiyan so shouldn't he be stronger than him anyway even if their bases were the same like i feel like goku doing better like, okay you know really, what that master that master super saiyan thing is just Cause the more we're talking about it, it's like the way he describes it. It's like not necessarily you increasing the multiplier per se, but it's like you decreasing the exhaustion you get from transforming in a way. Cause like I, so you know, I'll go back in there and say like his base form was just stronger, and it's like you get Super Saiyan, but you don't you don't get exhausted. Super Saiyan becomes basically what your base is. Like it has it has no type of <clears throat> no type of significant exhaustion on you okay so if you're gonna because there's kind of two routes for the super saiyan if you take the route where you believe if it's grade one two three or four they're all times 50 somehow then the whole thing would be okay the reason why they're difference in power is because grade four is the only one that keeps your strength so you're basically saying the longer you're in super saiyan the weaker you become is that is that it's the like, route yeah, it, 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 it's like yeah you you get exhausted. Basically, it's like con conserving energy. You're like, I look at at this point. I'm starting to look at Master Super Saiyan as like being able to put a maximum output without without no effort whatsoever. Like, I'll be like Goku. Like for example, Goku being able to spam Kamehameha's and not get as tired versus Vegeta spamming like his Final Flash or Gala Gun in Super Saiyan. It's like one of them will get tired way much quicker because it does take effort to keep the transformation so in terms of power grade two and grade four are the same it's just the fact that grade four can hold it longer so you think 